Did you know that the first pregnancy test in history was invented by the pharaohs? Let me explain. Over 3,000 years ago, women in ancient Egypt didn't have access to modern medicine, but they did have a very interesting way of finding out if they were pregnant. It was important to know if a woman was pregnant because in ancient Egypt, only women who gave birth to boys could be considered worthy. So every woman who suspected she might be pregnant would go through a special test. A woman would pee on barley and wheat seeds for seven days in a row, and by the eighth day, she would see the results. If the seeds had sprouted, it meant that she was pregnant. And if the seeds didn't sprout, it meant that she wasn't pregnant. But they didn't just stop there. They took it a step further by believing that the type of seed that sprouted could actually predict the gender of the baby. It meant that she was carrying a boy, and if the wheat sprouted, it meant that she was carrying a girl. Of course, today we know that this is just a myth, but back then they believed this test to be true and it was used for hundreds of years. Now, even though this test sounds ridiculous, and I mean, come on, it involves peeing on seeds. A study in the 20th century actually showed that it worked in some cases. The reason it worked is because pregnancy hormones can affect the growth of seeds. So in some cases, the test would actually tell you if the woman was pregnant or not. Even though it wasn't 100% accurate, it was still the world's first known pregnancy test, and it was used long before modern medicine was invented. So next time you think your pregnancy test is too complicated, just remember it could have been much worse. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.